How are cucumbers grown? In the context of the rapid development of the cucumber market in Eastern Europe, cucumber cultivation and production have become an indispensable part of modern agriculture. Mexico is the fifth largest producer of cucumbers in the world, accounting for 1.1% of total production. Meanwhile, the U.S. ranked 8th with 0.7%. And to better understand the cucumber growing process, we need to go deeper into the production and management process. Let's find out together how farmers around the world are applying to create high-quality cucumbers. Currently, there are many cucumber varieties bred for high yield, good disease resistance, and short harvest time. Police rely on the natural characteristics of the growing area to choose the most suitable cucumber variety. After choosing the type of seed, we will proceed to the next step of seed treatment. Prepare seed nursery trays, then spread specialized seed nursery soil evenly into the nursery trays. Each seed is one nursery pot. The nursery tray should be placed in a cool place with a misting system for watering to retain moisture and create conditions for seeds to germinate. After 7 to 10 days, the tree will have leaves and can be planted. The root system of cucumber is quite weak and has poor absorption, so the soil needs to be highly porous, well-drained, have a lot of organic matter, and the soil pH is between 5.5 to 6.5. Before being put into use, the land needs to be plowed carefully, then form mounds of suitable size for the method of planting. It can be planted in one row or two rows on one mound. You should cover their surface with plastic film to limit weeds, keep the soil moist, limit pests as well as increase productivity and quality of plants. On those mounds of land, we continue to create soil holes to plant trees with a density of 30 cm between trees and a distance of 60 cm between rows. The nutritional needs of cucumber plants are quite high. When the plant grows large, it is necessary to increase the amount of watering and supplement necessary in nutrients periodically. Plants lacking water will grow stunted, produce poor fruit, small fruit, and even bitter fruit. If the plant has too much water, the leaves will turn yellow and productivity will decrease. To ensure the amount of water supplied to plants, you can use a drip irrigation system so you won't have to worry about lack or excess water when supplying. Two weeks after planting, when the plants are about 15 to 20 centimeters, people start making trellises for cucumbers to stimulate the plants to produce more fruit, reduce pests and disease, and facilitate care and fruit collection. You can use wooden stakes from 1 to 3 meters long combined with long steel wires to make a climbing trellis and then fix the tree on that climbing trellis system. Normally, after about 35 to 45 days of planting, depending on the variety, we can harvest the first cucumber crop. 
Be sure to harvest fruit that is large enough for a high yield and best quality. Before and during harvest, farmers need to supplement nutrients for the plants. It is best at this stage for people to use organic fertilizers to be safer for consumers. Fruits should be harvested early in the morning and in the cool afternoon. Fertilization and watering will be carried out so that the tree can continue to produce the next batch of fruit. After harvesting, hundreds of tons of cucumbers will be brought to the factory for processing steps. An attractive dish from this fruit that you can try is pickled cucumber. After being harvested, the melon will be cleaned then combined with some other ingredients such as chili, garlic, and then pickled. Each factory will have its own recipe. But after 3-4 to four days, you will have a crispy cucumber dish that is both sour and sweet, making a strong impression on diners right from the very first time they enjoy it. As a popular, available, and cheap food, cucumber is loved by many people. In cucumbers, water accounts for 90%. The rest are vitamins, natural minerals, or calcium, iron, magnesium, phosphorus, potassium, zinc, which not all foods have. Therefore, eating cucumbers every day will be the best, most effective, and simplest method for you to provide nutrients to your body, especially a rich and diverse source of natural vitamins and minerals. With some great benefits such as helps prevent cancer very effectively, good for the digestive system, supports the heart, restores vision, eliminates toxins, good for diabetes, and supports weight loss, Cucumber has become an indispensable part of every daily meal. That's the end of today's video. What do you think about today's topic? Please comment below to let us know. If you are passionate about exploring, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel so you can watch all the interesting and exciting videos ahead. And now, goodbye and see you again in the next video.